everyone, I am Paul Kothari and I am here with Learn and Fun with me. Today, I am going to show you a fun physics experiment. The aim for the experiment is to create a water fountain using air pressure. Isn't that exciting? The materials required for the experiment are a bottle, two straws and a glass or a plastic container. So without further ado, let's get started. The procedure for the experiment is Take the cap of the bottle. Make two holes so the straws perfectly fit in it. You can make the holes either with a scissor or a sharp material. Put the straws in such a way that one looks shorter and the other looks larger. The holes should be having gap between them so the straws remain far from them. Then seal the straws with the glue gun or glue so the air doesn't pass out. Then attach the lid on the bottle and make sure it's tight enough. You can also use a balloon for the experiment. All you need to do is to inflate the balloon then attach it to the top and release the air so it creates pressure inside the bottle and the water is poured into the container. But for this experiment, I'm not going to use a balloon. I'm going to use my own lungs. So it's time to experiment. Did you just see that? The water came flowing like a waterfall. A question just rose up my mind. What if the straws were of the same level inside the bottom? Do you know the answer? Well, we both don't know it. So, why don't we experiment it right now? I've changed the level of the bigger straw and made it equal with the smaller straw, as you can see. Now, we shall experiment our thoughts. I'm going to airtight this properly and I'm going to do the same process with my lungs. It's still working. So, both the processes are successful. Do you know why this experiment worked out? This happens due to air pressure. When the air from our lungs or the balloon gets released in the bottle, it creates a positive pressure in the bottle. As the volume of the bottle is fixed, water gets put out of the bottle through the other straw and creates a fountain. All around us, everything on earth is equally squeezed by the atmosphere. Air pressure also squeezes us in all the directions. A similar thing happens inside your fountain. The water in the bottle is squeezed by the height of the water top of it. I hope you all have understood the concept of air pressure. Thank you everyone. Stay tuned.